What's up guys, welcome back to another video. It's Kile, aka Major Lay, and today, as you can tell by the title, we're doing another try on haul, but this time it's gonna be a fall try on haul. And it's gonna be with my series, hashtag fall with play. So make sure you click on the hashtag so therefore you can watch all the other videos and the videos I'm gonna post furthermore. So if you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe, 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 subscribe. <laughs> Every time I do that, it's like a tongue twister. Turn on that post notification bell so therefore you're notified whenever I make a video. Share this video. Make sure you repost, reshare, and tag me at Keelay Welch and I will repost it. I'll repost it on my Instagram or wherever you share it. So definitely do that and let's just get into the video. As you can tell, I have this big ass box right here. That's the box that all my clothes came in. So I spent over $350 on this fashion overhaul so make sure you watch it and share it and subscribe because I'm about to give y'all some good as fall clothes okay and let me know if you guys want me to do a video on me styling these items oh, look at the big ass box <laughs> I'm put it right here okay so I'm gonna start off with the shoes I did get two pairs of shoes um so this is the first one and it is in a size eight these shoes right here, these are about to be my new favorite. Like, oh, these are about to be my new favorite babies. You ready? Are you guys ready? Wait, hold on. It even came in like little, oh, you guys saw a little bit. Look, it came in like little cloths, cloth, cloths to keep it fresh. But are you guys ready? Boom. Wait, okay, look at that. Look at the detail. Can you guys see that? Like, oh my gosh. Those are so cute. These are red snakeskin boots, booties, AKA. Um, I'm so excited. You know, fall colors are dark reds. What's the color, burgundy? Yeah, burgundy, wine, wine red. Um, dark oranges, light oranges, green, yellow, all those dark colors. So when I saw this, I had to get it because these statement piece right here, like, oof, oof, picture is coming soon, baby. Oh, I'm so excited. So those are my first pairs of shoes that I got. You guys, I got lots of good stuff, so make sure you watch. So this whole entire haul, I have around 15 pieces. Um, which cost about $350, so like, I don't know if you're on a budget, but they're kind of like expensive. They're like cheap slash expensive, mid expensive, if that makes sense. Um, I'll post, or I'm not post, I'll show the pictures on the screen and do like a, oh, excuse me, I keep burping, and do a side by side so you guys can see what it looks like on the model and what it looks like in real life. These are my second pairs of shoes. I had to get some knee highs. Girlfriend or boyfriend. <laughs> I'm so excited. Like, oh my God. Look at that. Oh, I can't wait to wear her. Oh. So this is like a new color, beige, whatever you want to call it, beige or nude. Um, I had to get a pair of knee highs. Well, this color, I already had black ones, but I wanted to get like some nude ones. So therefore, I can pair it with other outfits and some outfits that I have in this video um, that I'm about to show you guys. So that's also in a size 8. Um, and make sure you guys stay tuned because I have a coupon code I'll put in the description box down below so you guys can get money off your orders. So make sure you guys look forward to that. So I'm going to start with these jeans first. Um, let's see, I don't even remember the sizes I got. Because they're kind of tricky, you know? You think you're this size, but then you're not. So then you have to size up. Or it's the other way around. You think you're this size and you're not, so you gotta size down. So I got these pair of pants. They're so cute. So it looks like this, and it has the rips in them. And they're skinny. So I thought they were darker though. They look darker on the website. So this is a size 13, 14, cause my butt did get bigger. Um, So we're just gonna try these on. Okay, so this is the jeans. They do fit pretty nice. I have, oh, that's the back side. 
They're kind of loose, but it's okay because I like the way they feel. They're not too tight. Um, and they are, what do you call this? Thigh? No, I forgot what that's called. What is that called again? Damn, why can't I think of it? High-waisted, high-waisted, that's what it's called. So yeah, they are high-waisted jeans, skinny jeans, and they have some rips in them, and it makes it look really cute. They look nice, they feel nice, and nice item. So this one, ooh, this is my shirt I got. You guys, I'll put it on the screen, okay? So it looks like this. You're probably looking at it like, what the fuck? But once you put it on and I'll wrap it around and stuff, you'll see what it looks like. Um, this is in a size large because it's stretchy. Whenever something's stretchy, I like to size up so therefore it's not too tight and it's like comfortable. So I'm about to try that on right now. Okay, so this is the shirt. You are, you're, you're like supposed to crisscross it and like tie it in the front. And then that's how it looks in the back. But I probably wouldn't wear this with a bra. I have a bra on right now, so that's why you see it black. But this is a really cute fall shirt. I like this. It's that wine color once again. It gives you something, you know, a little cleavage. But you have a little skin here and there. And then it still covers you up. So here it is. And then there's the back once again. So like I said, if you guys want a video of me styling these clothes, like for sure, comment down below. Cause I will, okay? I will. So next we have this like copper looking silky satin shirt. I did catch this one on sale. I thought it was kind of cute, so let me see. I forgot how it goes. This is how it looks. It's copper, then it has like black lace at the top. And it's kind of like cami style, so let me just change into that real quick so therefore you know what it looks like okay so here's the next shirt it's copper and it has the black lace at the bottom this is really cute you can also pair this with a jacket on top it's a it's stretchy but i feel like i probably should have sized up a little bit i don't know it's really cute though shows a little of the girls i really like the slit detailing right here how it gives you like that little like action that's so cute this is adorable i like this next shirt you guys i'm so good at picking stuff like on oh god like i know how to dress so this i got is a gray like sweater crop top you guys are gonna look at these like, what the fuck is that? But when I put it on, you're gonna be like, oh my God, I gotta get that. And yes, sis, you do. So let's try it on. Okay, so next we have this crisscross um, crop top sweater. This is cute if you wanna wear a sweater, but you also don't wanna like cover too much, if that makes sense. Like you don't wanna be hot, but you also don't wanna be cold. You feel what I'm saying? And it gives you nice little like, action in the front to make it like it's like a what do you call this sweetheart neckline i forget but um it's nice and flirty it's stretchy too like everything is like stretchy material and that's one thing i like as well okay so let's continue on and try on another shirt okay so next we have this oversized sweater right here this is so cute it's a wine color once again oh my god i just sneezed okay so like i was saying there's this wine color um, oversized sweater then it has like a cute little slit in the middle to show some you know skin and then it also has this cute like buckle detailing and I thought that was just really different so I had to get it and let's just see what it looks like on okay so here's the oversized sweater it's another crisscross type of thing um, and it also gives you like I said that slit so you have one or two options you can either wear this with like an undershirt on um, if you don't want to show that much or you don't have to you can just wear it like this so therefore you have that peekaboo action um, This is what the back looks like. It's oversized like I said, and this is so cute like this is different. It's new um, This will also be really nice for styling. So I Like this That's what it looks like. So I am gonna try on my next pair of pants right here. So these are um, Like cream slash off-white like faux leather pants and they're so cute like I can't wait to try this on the only issue is they're kind of like legging style and I hope it stays on my waist like 
ladies i know you you know that feeling where like you wear something and it doesn't stay on your waist like it just keeps slipping down and you constantly have to pull it up all day long so i hope that this is not that so let's go ahead and just try it on okay so here are the faux leather pants like i said in the um cream color now they were not kidding when they said faux leather like this shit is tight so like you really gonna have to jump into this um it is like skinnies at the bottom and they feel really nice too like they're so cute and you could pair this look with like anything like i can even pair this with this sweater and put like the snakeskin boots i had so if you don't want your pants really tight guys like i said size up most definitely but I'm gonna change the shirt because I'm starting to get hot. <laughs> so let's go ahead and change the shirt. But this is just a regular wine bodysuit and it does have like a little pocket right here. So that's really cute. Um, I could pair this with like literally anything. Probably wouldn't wear this with this because this is really tight. I even feel like buckling it at the bottom if you know what I mean because like it's just tight. <laughs> but it does feel really nice and lightweight so therefore you won't get hot. And it's also like a v-neck type so that's what it looked like and let's just try something else on so here's the next outfit it is a sweater two-piece set um i got it in biker shorts and like a crop sweater so it is a little baggy i should have got like a size down the only thing is i wanted this to be more so comfortable and not tight so that's why i went up a size but i mean it'll do it just looks like i have like a pouch like a <laughs> I don't know what you want to call that but yeah they're really cute this is more so like lounging or like going somewhere and you're not really like doing anything really special but you want to be more comfortable you know so I did save the best for last like I have three more so I do have this half and half um oversized I don't know what you call this jacket sweater but I was gonna wear this like just like this and then wear some knee highs either my black or my red booty so let's see what it looks like on okay so here it is um it's a little baggy because um i was gonna wear it just like this but i did get something recently i got those corset things that you can put on your waist and it'll cinch it and make it look even cuter so i will be putting that on but here's the back it's just like an oversized shirt and let's just see what the corset looks like like it's gonna look so good guys here's the corset i was talking about this right here is my sweat no but um it looks so cool and cute it gives it that black you know that half black action this is lit low key this is lit like that's the back because it gives you like that shape too and then it looks cute at the same time. And let's try on the other one. This? Oh my god. Like, I'm fucking... I'm that bitch. Because <laughs> my clothes, like, this is about to be lit. This is about to be a lit fall. And I possibly need to get more clothes. We got this half denim, half plaid. And it also has, like, the fringe detailing going across. And this looks so cool. This is, like, another version of this. And I would wear this with like my beige knee highs, like bruh. Can y'all imagine with this probably? I don't know, we gonna see. But yeah, let's just try it on. Okay, so here's the other one. It's supposed to be the same style as the half black and half red plaid one. So this is what it looks like. Although this one feels a little bit shorter. So I don't know if I would wear this just like this. Um, if I did, I'd probably put like shorts underneath or I'll probably wear this like biker shorts or jeans so to match like the jean going on at the top but this does feel really nice like it's not scratchy it gives you like that jean jacket type of feel at the top and then like the really soft plaid at the bottom so i really like this this is really different and let's just try we got two more items y'all two more items so let's go okay guys so this is the next item it is this latex nude color shirt crop shirt i really like this like when i first saw it i was like yeah i had to get that because i'm the type of person like i love latex latex anything um shirt pants dress bodysuit i just think it complements you so well and it looks so cute dress this up and dress this down once again 
if you're going out you know at night time want to have like a little date or if you're just doing it casual like you see here i just paired it with these jeans um and you can put a jacket over it which i'm about to do now and show you my last item so let me show you that okay so this is the last item i just got this cute sherpa jacket trying to let it focus so you can see that so that's what it looks like and i'm gonna put it on right now like tell me this is not cute it has pockets like it's a sherpa like bomber jacket and this is something you could pair over you know when it gets chilly or windy at night and you want like a jacket so i thought that was really cute the only thing is this is strapless so you got to be kind of careful because it might fall down a little bit so just make sure you're aware okay guys so that is the end of this video if you enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up it does help me a lot if you're new to the channel go ahead and subscribe and this shout out um does go to newski dooski so i am doing shout outs um if you subscribe to my channel and and you turn on that post notification bell and you comment done you will get a shout out in the next video so thank you nooski dooski and stay tuned for my next videos i will be doing some vlogs for the fall so stay tuned <laughs> so thank you so much and see you in my next video